boys and girls and welcome to the official Poppins Learning 321 channel. Here we love to find new and exciting ways to learn and grow. One of those ways is by reading. Are you ready to hear a story today? Great! Me too! The title of today's story is called Coco Melon's Colorful Day. Once upon a time, in a cozy little house, lived a curious toddler named Coco Melon. Coco Melon had bright blue eyes and a smile that could light up a room. He loved exploring and discovering new things. One sunny morning, Coco Melon woke up feeling excited. Today was going to be a special day. As he jumped out of bed, he noticed a rainbow of color streaming through his window. Pokemelon's eyes widened with delight as he knew it was going to be a colorful adventure. Pokemelon's day began with a splash of yellow. He put on his favorite yellow raincoat and ran outside to play in the sun. The bright yellow daisies swayed in the gentle breeze. Coco Melon giggled as he caught the golden rays of sunlight on his outstretched arms. Next, Coco Melon came across a vibrant red apple. He took a big bite and felt the juicy sweetness fill his mouth. Red was the color of excitement and energy, and Coco Melon's heart raced with joy as he twirled around, pretending to be a spinning top. As Coco Melon continued his colorful day, he stumbled upon a pile of orange leaves. He kicked them up in the air, creating a shower of autumn hues. Orange was the color of warmth and happiness, and Coco Melon's laughter echoed through the air as he jumped into the leafy pile. Then, Coco Melon discovered a patch of green grass where butterflies danced among the flowers. He laid down and gazed up at the blue sky peeking through the leaves. Green was the color of nature and calmness. And Coco Melon took a deep breath, feeling peaceful and content. As Coco Melon walked along, he noticed a group of children painting with brushes dipped in blue paint. He joined them and dipped his own brush into the paint, creating swirling patterns on the paper. Blue was the color of imagination and dreams, and Coco Melon's imagination soared as he painted a picture of a smiling sun and a friendly elephant. Next, Coco Melon spotted a bunch of purple balloons floating in the air. He jumped up and reached for them, trying to catch one. Purple was the color of creativity and magic, and Coco Melon felt a sense of wonder as he watched the balloons dance above him. In the distance, Coco Melon saw a rainbow stretching across the sky. Each color sparkled and blended into the next, forming a magnificent arch. Coco Melon couldn't contain his excitement and he ran towards the rainbow hoping to find a pot of gold at the end. But instead of a pot of gold, Coco Melon found something even more precious. He discovered a field of wildflowers, each one a different color of the rainbow. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple flowers danced in the breeze. Coco Melon sat down in the midst of the colorful blooms, feeling a sense of awe and wonder at the beauty around him. As the sun began to set, casting a warm golden glow, Coco Melon headed back home. He climbed into bed, feeling tired but content. 
his dreams, he imagined a world where every day was as colorful and joyful as this one. The next morning, as Coco Melon woke up to start a new day, he carried the memory of his colorful adventure in his heart. He knew that the world was a vibrant place, full of beauty and happiness. And with each new day, Coco Melon would continue to explore and find joy in the endless array of colors that surrounded him. And so, Coco Melon's colorful day came to an end, but the love for colors and the magic they held would forever remain in his heart. The end. Well, that's all for today. If you like this story, make sure to like and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for tuning in. Bye-bye.